Here's my Coleman 1700 2000 uh, generator. There's my Hobart um, flux welder. Um, this is my Craftsman circuit uh, table saw. There's my Craftsman compressor. Uh, there's our com compactor. Four drawer filing cabinet. Here's my uh, fence pounder. There's the starter to my tractor, which I was rebuilding. Here's tools. There's a a good tool there. I need to get a, some gloves on and get that bar out of here. I'll take that with me. And I think this jack, look at the, the jack actually actually melted. That jack is totaled. It's bent. It's arced. Unless I could get it straightened somehow. I don't know. Okay. And there is my Honeywell. 7500 through 8500. Um generator toolboxes that in the back corner there is a craftsman workbench that I got at Costco over here is a freezer that we kept in the garage mini uh, dust grinder this bent pipe here is an air system for my compressor um, this is a couple of pounds of roofing nails that went with my boss stitch uh, roofing um, hammer, air hammer. Um, this is a hand truck dolly. Uh, paint. Nuts and bolts. Um, this is a chimney stack that was in storage. This is a gorilla shelving system. This is an electric 220, 240 oven stove. There's a mailbox. These are animal pins. This was an architect table. There's a power supply that I had. Um, this is a three stack tool uh, uh, tool chest, craftsman. This is the cabinet that held much of my reloading gear that didn't didn't bear out too well it looks like a battery pack of some kind I'm trying to think of what that was okay there's two circular saws that I had when I had it, and there's my pipe wrenches. I had three of those, of different, three different sizes. Um, there were my clamps in there. Uh, it's a brand new water heater, electric water heater, a state model, 40 gallon. Um, there's a magazine rack. Bunch of dishes. Danny, do you want to get any of these dishes? If you get those gloves that I gave you, you can handle those. Looks like some of them survived. Ceramic makes it. There's an aluminum ladder that's a six foot right there. Somewhere I had an eight foot. I had two different eight foots. I had one. There's, oh, that looks 
looks kind of melted. Horseshoes. I don't know what the metal horseshoes are doing over here. They should have been over in the over there. Things have been moved around. Well, this ladder, I don't know. It does look distorted. Yeah, it's it's totaled. Okay, and this composting thing is all melted and distorted. The shredder was working, and it's a Troy, a Troy built. Um, shredder. Looks like we got some trees that got to come down all over the place. Okay, here's a animal pen. That's pretty much t melted and totaled. There was tarps on there, heavy-duty tarps. Here's an uh, animal stanchion for the goat. That's totaled. There were three bales of alfalfa in there. They're gone. Uh-oh. It looks like uh, my rototiller is totaled. That's a brand new engine I just put on there. That's totaled. There's a Rainier cherry tree and two Bing cherry trees. One one of the Bings look like it's going to make it. And then there's an apple tree over there. That's iffy. And there's an apple tree over here. It just looks like it dis oh it's bent over there. That might make it. Okay, we got some fencing. Looks like it's going to make it. Got rolls of fence in the back. Looks like that could make it. This tree needs to come out. This tree needs to come out. This tree needs to come out. Those trees need to come out and that tree needs to come out. Those trees over there have to come out. I hear that they're dying. Any of any the ones left standing are dying after they burnt like that. It cleared the lot behind us. I think that cherry's going to make it. Let's go look at the trailer. There was a cord of wood stacked right here. That's gone. Oh, look at this tree. That needs to go. The P2 probably means to cut it. Just the frame left on this PJ's trailer. Looks like the ducting made it. Amazing metal can take things, but wood doesn't. Okay. Okay, we had a 47 inch Vizio TV that was about to get a new capacitor that was in here. Microwave oven is gone. where the microwave was over there and I had one in my garage too and this is ducting that I had all wrapped in uh, here's a step stool totaled computer total Sure. Hard to make out some of this stuff. 
Here's some uh, piano hinges, gone. Piano hinges, gone, two piano hinges. A stand. Some of this stuff I'm not even sure what it is. Looks like uh, fuel tanks. Yeah, that's what's left of a TV. There's a coil of wire in there, gone. A lot of piers, gone. Boy, this really did take it out. Yanmar F-15 tractor, four-wheel drive with a front loader, Bueller Allied front loader, totaled. Ford F-250, smog, ready to go, in good shape, totaled, inside and out. Extra leaf springs. Here's a Northern Tool winch, total, totally gone. There's a collection to go to the dump. Wow. Here is a Freestanding pedestal um, bathroom sink. It looks like the branches fell on it or something fell on it because it's gone. It was on a pallet right there, ready to be installed. Here are two Ford F-250 running boards. They were in pristine condition, they're gone. This was a Briggs & Stratton engine. It just needed the fuel cleaned out of it. It would have been in good shape. This is a Lazy Boy that was going back to Lazy Boy for flaws. There's a file cabinet back there, uh, portable. There were two shelves across the back of the wall that went 10 feet long. And brackets, they were the solid brackets. There's two folding chairs and a lawn rake. Those two wheelbarrows. There's a chamber pot. I can't make out a lot of this. I know there was a lot of stuff in here. Um, just amazing. I'll figure this out later. There is a ramp for a car. There was miscellaneous herbs and spices in here, and uh, three uh, juniper or junipers or no, no Italian cypresses, not junipers. Three Italian cypresses. Here is our garden raised bed. Um, good luck with figuring that out as far as the amount of lumber I had in that, and all of the drip system that I had in here. It was a bunch of drip. Wow. Here is a vice. Heavy duty vice. There was another lighter vice on the on the bench. It's probably down in that. There's a bunch of clamps. C clamps. Here's some jacks. As I said, my uh, Hobart welder. There was a stand over there. There was, there was a uh, dust bin right there, or a trash bin. 
Uh, there's chairs, stools, and shelves that just totally disintegrated in this mess, plus a ton of nails and screws and uh, did you look for... Okay.